With the recent normalization between Turkey and Greece, with the step taken by President Erdogan, can bridges of hearts be rebuilt between Turkey and Greece? Why not after all our neighbor? If it does not disturb us in our national security issues, why not, if it at least implements a win-win policy regarding the steps we take in the interests of our own country? Of course, we do not want to be enemies with Greece or any other country. We are always on the side of friendship. We are a country that acts with the motto of peace at home and peace in the world. But from time to time, Countries can be strained in line with their own interests or due to the wrong steps taken by some countries, these relations can be strained. Currently, a normalization phase has been passed. During President Erdogan's visit to Greece, there was a project initiated their bridge border bridge between Greece and Turkey. The foundations of this bridge will now be laid. As long as we act with good intentions, let's focus on the big picture. The details of the second bridge between Turkey and Greece have become clear. Minister of Transport and Infrastructure Abdulkadi Yurolulu shared the details of the new border bridge. Our projects and investments that will carry us into the future. The existing Ipsalakipi bridge over the Evros River was built in 1958. Minister Yurolulu stated that the bridge, which is heavily used by heavy vehicles and tourists, is insufficient. He reminded that it was decided to build a second bridge with a memorandum of understanding signed in Athens on January 22, 2004. According to the agreement, the bridge project will be built at the Kipiatsala border crossing. It will end in Salivri. The length of the line, including the bridge, will be 180 kilometers. The bridge will have four lanes, two inbound and two outbound. The distance between the deck of the bridge over the Evros River and the river surface will be 10 meters. In addition, the construction of the bridge will be tendered separately for the Greek side and the Turkish side. A joint audit group will be formed to supervise these companies.